Hello everybody, this is Andy from Rotterdam. <laughs> uh, today we're going to talk about craniospinal treatment a la Parisienne. <laughs> and well, this is it. I made a, a scale model of what I saw in the Gustave Roussy hospital in Paris. Um, and they made it all out of polystyrene. Uh, two big uh, parts of polystyrene, five centimeters thick each. Uh, they were glued uh, together. This is the least important part. This is the support for the feet. And this is where it comes more important. What they did is uh, and I don't care what you think about it, but I'm just going to show this. Eh? I'm just going to share this with you. Um, this, the red part over here, was a uh, red uh, head support. And they used something like this. You know this one from, from Simmet, uh, Sivco, Macromedics, you know. Um, and they've cut this one in, in half so they cut it over here like so they put this away and they only had this part and th this part was glued here and this was to support uh, the forehead and yeah and they made a little um, how should I call it a little hole in the polystyrene and this was to support the chin yeah okay this the, the, the I, I i colored it orange and blue this was to uh, support the head and to prevent a rotation of the head yeah um, and this was to to align the shoulders to 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 make sure the shoulders were in the same position so well i still got my uh, little friend over here to show you how they did it so it ended up like this see so yeah. hope you can see this uh, very well so the chin and the forehead was supported they cut this uh, polystyrene part um, in exactly the same size, so and everything was glued together. Yeah, and even the shoulder uh, supports. Um, they first draw uh, on a piece of paper, so they, so they outlined their patient on a piece of paper, uh, mostly children, by the way, um, and then they. Uh, cut the polystyrene in exactly the same size and what they did and a moment please so they will put the patient on there in a sorry so they will put the patient on there in a straight line yeah and then they would take uh, the uh, polystyrene shoulder part and they would hold it against the patient and then they would glue it to the polystyrene uh, uh, base yeah so this is their uh, well it's the Gustave Roussy uh, craniospinal uh, positioning technique <laughs> uh, so it's uh, and they were very happy with it but okay they they didn't my, like their own uh, prone uh, solution so they wanted to change to something else and they were gonna probably gonna use the uh, macromedic DSPS double shell positioning system uh, with prone uh, support uh, 
Yeah, but okay. I just wanted to show you this because it's always uh, nice to see uh, what other people are doing, isn't it? And what you think of it, that's secondary. <laughs> uh, but I wanted to share this with you. See? Yippee. Let's uh, just uh, walk around. Ah, there it is, Gustave Roussy. So, uh, well, I hope you liked it. Uh, so, it's uh, goodbye from me and uh, little Gustav. Bye bye.